My name is John Storm. I'm from Kitchener, Ontario. I grew up in Kitchener. I went to school in Ottawa to university and moved here with my wife because she's from here. A mentor for me uh, is my own mother. When I grew up in Kitchener, I went away to university and I came home and it was a time of a, a starvation in Biafra or somewhere in Africa. I began to cry and I said to my parents, why do we have the cars? Why do we have this house? And my mother, who's an uneducated woman, looked at me and she said, we can't solve the problems of the whole world, but you'll be okay because you think about those people. What makes my day or week is meeting someone who's an active thinker, someone who wonders about the world, someone who's not afraid to ask questions about the world because we have a lot of people who are not like that. Something that people, some people don't know about myself is during the daytime, I am the director of Oxford Learning in St. Catharines. Hundreds of kids over the years have told me what's going on in their head, their heart, and their tummy. And when we listen in a particular way, without advice and without giving them, you know, a, a lecture, these kids open up. It has really shaped me over the years. Some of the people that I've interviewed, um, these are remarkable people with remarkable stories. But I also understand that there's that hidden person, that, vo that person with no voice, we have to work for that person too. We have to start talking to each other once again and learning from each other once again because there are people who have an amazing recollection of what this region was like a long time ago. If you take an elderly person, it's not my idea, but when an elderly person dies, it's like a library burning down. Let's talk to those people now. Let's talk to the 10-year-olds and let's talk to the, the youth who really don't know where they're going in this world. There are too many people who are living inauthentic lives. And if we know what we have inside of us, we have love, we have wisdom, we have patience. If people want to better their lives somehow, here's an idea, just a simple idea. Get up off the couch. Do that as much as you can and you will discover an entire region that you don't know about. You will discover people who are remarkable in their stories. But when we sit still in our own homes and don't get out, then you won't learn it. So let's begin to be like a little town again. Let's get to know everyone because there are some great people out there with ideas and sure, some hurt and some, some woes. But I'm telling you, if we talk to one another and if we learn how to listen more effectively, I promise you it will be a much stronger community.